Uh, the example three, point A, B, C are the free vertex of a triangle. Prove that triangle A, B, C is right angle triangle and hence find the area. Well, actually, this is quite similar to example two. And then again, we have to draw the diagram by ourselves first. But we can see that uh, for point A, B, C, they have all positive y coordinates, 4, 2, 0. And the x coordinates are 1, negative 3, and plus 3. So if we can draw it in this way, we have the x axis right here. And the y axis can be in the middle because the x coordinates are from start from negative 3 to plus 3. And we can simply omit the negative y-axis because all the coordinates, y-coordinates are positive or zero. So point A, it will be 1, 4. Point B, minus 3, plus 2. And for point C, we have 3, 0. 3, 0. So this is our triangle A, B, C. And now we have to prove that triangle A, B, C is a right angle triangle. And probably angle A will be the right angle. But this is not necessarily true because this diagram is not drawn to scale. So how can we prove that it is a right angle? And uh, we can make use of the, remember in form 2, the converse of Pythagoras free. We have to first find the length of all the sides of the triangle ABC and then we add up the square of the two smaller sides and see the sum whether the sum is equal to the length the square of the longer side. So we have to find A B and uh, A C and finally B, C. Therefore, A, B. A, C. And B, C. And for A, B, we can start with point A. That's one, four. And then, uh, for point B, we have negative 3. Minus negative 3, we have plus 3. And then minus 2. And for A, C, again, we start with 1, 4. And uh, for point C, we have C, 3, 0. Minus 3, minus 0. For point B, we have minus 3, negative 2. And then uh, for point C, we have 3, 0. Minus 3, minus 0. And we can check this, this should be root 20. And again for AEC we have as a square of 2, we have 4, 4 plus 16. Again root 20. For BC we have the square of 6, we have 36 plus 4, we have root 40. And so it is quite obvious that the square of AB plus the square of AC, this are the two shorter sides. And the sum will equal to the square of BC. So we can write this in this way. Square of AB plus square of AC. We just find this expression, the value of this expression. And it happens that this equals to the square of BC. Therefore, triangle A, oh, sorry, Triangle A, B, C is right angled. And, uh, but actually, we can do more than this. A, B e also equals to A, C. So it is also an isosceles triangle. And we can do something more, do something extra. A, B equals to A, C. Therefore, triangle A, B, C is isosceles.